Hi, everybody. It's Ken McLaughlin. Welcome to the Remax Homework Connect Virtual Award Ceremony. You know, I was thinking this has been this is our 41st award ceremony, and I never would have guessed that we'd be doing virtual awards like we did last year. But I'm so grateful to be in front of you. It's been a year, as unbelievable as that sounds. Time has dragged. It has flown by. March of last year, we all had to make some remarkable decisions. Decisions based on unknown factors. The pandemic we all are in and continue to be in was new to us, and our reactions were new as well. We weren't able to or going to be able to be in control of what had happened, but we could control how we responded. After taking a quick reset, we all had to get to work. So how did you do? 12 months, countless obstacles, countless difficulties, countless dilemmas and stresses, but also countless opportunities. Not only did each of us have to step up personally, but we had to step up for our families, our community, and our peers. We learned to really be there for others, and you were. We learned to make sure we got to work under a different set of parameters. We created and utilized countless opportunities to grab hold of our new business and provide for our clients and our families. If we allowed it, the pandemic could have easily overtaken our lives as well as destroying our character. For many, this pandemic took an incredible toll on our lives. It continues to do so even today. But today, I want you to look at your successes and be proud of them. If you just managed to hang on, be grateful for that. If you were able to maintain your business, be grateful for that. And if you were able to grow your business, be grateful for that. We all have an opportunity to learn from our actions and to celebrate our way of being in the past 12 months and to take the time to acknowledge what we all have been through. Let's give ourselves the acknowledgement for a job well done through the most collectively difficult time many of us have ever faced. Hallmark is celebrating as well. We've learned a lot about the character of our company. The hardest day in my real estate career was the day we had to ask our staff to go home without really knowing when we would be able to call them back. We did call them back. I am proud of our team, our leadership group, our support staff, and certainly of all our realtors. Keep growing, keep making a difference, and above all, be grateful. I know I am, and I congratulate and thank all of you. Hi there. Well, it is that time of year again, awards, and it's always so much fun and uh, really exciting to be able to share this, this wonderful news with everybody uh, at this time of the year. And of course, when it's awards season, I have my normal reminder that I like to do every year. So you're going to have to listen to one minute of Mark before we acknowledge these amazing achievements once again in 2020. And that is this. There's an old saying, and the saying is, uh, one and one don't make two, one and one make eleven. And by that I mean the combined collective can have a success much stronger than just in the individual. So today we celebrate individual award winners, but remember the collective success of everybody here creates market share. And the market share domination that we have is higher than ever before, thanks to the great and unbelievable efforts of this entire company. So these achievements will recognize individually, but remember that they create market share that everybody wins. Nobody got to this level by themselves. They all had their path to get here. And along the way, I like to think they got some help from either the leadership team or through the resources at the company or through you, through each other, through going to meetings, through networking with each other, through talking in the halls and learning that one little thing that helped you get better. So the culmination of that is a lot of success, a lot of market share that everybody can use and a lot of awards. So, shall I read them off? I Yeah, I think you should. I'm recovering from those deep thoughts. But <laughs> what I'd like to say before Mark reads these off is that if you're watching this, it means that you're still in business. And that is no small feat because COVID threw a knuckleball at all of us. And you got through it because of your professionalism, and because of your integrity and so for that we applaud all of you and we congratulate all of you so let's read those and i'm still going to try and figure out the one and one eleven thing while mark reads those out she'll get back to you on that i'll send her a note afterwards okay so we're going to talk about simcoe county obviously and uh, the glasses are out starting with 
our rising star for 2020 for Simcoe County. That is a lovely lady named Chantal Ballantyne. Chantal, congratulations, rising star. Well done. Uh, our number one CMN contributor for 2020, Simcoe County, is Scott Woolsey. Scott Woolsey there and the team, Scott. congratulations. That's something to obviously truly be proud of. Well done, guys, well done. Now, getting into some sales numbers. The number one commercial realtor for Simcoe County 2020 is Rob McDonough. Rob, well done. We all know how hard you work, that's for sure. Number one commercial team in Simcoe County is the Wayne Hay team. Wayne and Zach, well done. You guys are always at it. Uh, congratulations, guys. Well done. Uh, number one for individual units sold in 2020 in Simcoe County. I think most of you know who this gentleman is. So you'll, you'll hear him cursing on Tuesday mornings, and we have to edit them out, but his name is George Nagel. George, congratulations, number one, 2020, and number of unit sales. Well done, sir. And next, number one for volume in 2020 in Simcoe County. Uh, he's going to be very happy to hear this because I know how he thinks. And he's a very, he's a very competitive guy who likes to, to, to achieve great things, but also is a wonderful man to share information as well. Nigel Davies is our number one individual for volume in 2020. Well done, Nigel. Sherry, well done. Yeah, I know you're, you're important behind the show. Um, Next, we have the number one team for numbers of units and volume in 2020 Simcoe County, the Peggy Hill team. Peggy, once again, you continue to amaze everyone pretty much on the globe with your success. So congratulations. Well done. Good to have you in the mix here to help uh, sharing some of your thoughts with the other agents as well now. Well done. Congratulations, all of you. And uh, I think we'll move on to our next speaker. Anything to sign off, Corey? No, I don't think so. I think uh, Mark pretty well said it all. and. Uh... I understand what he meant now. He means that we are greater than the sum of our parts. What Thank you. Mean? Thank you. Okay. Hey, Simcoe County. What a privilege it is a year after COVID to look back at all of your success. You reacted and absolutely crushed it. Uh, our top 10 individuals uh, for Simcoe County is a very distinguished list. Number 10 is Heather Jones from Minnesville. Number nine is Angela Cristini from Bayfield. Number eight is Ted Tazaris from Alliston. Number seven is uh, Brando Schmidt from Bayfield. Brandon, way to go. Number six is Nigel Davies from Kaplan. Number five is Mary Bateman from Bayfield. Number four is Mike Guerrera from Alliston. Number three is Jamie Bowman from Alliston. Number two is none other than George Nagel from Bayfield. And number one is Rob, McDon Rob McDonald from Tottenham. Once again, congratulations. It's an amazing accomplishment. This year will never be forgotten and we're very, very proud of all of your success. Cheers. Hi everyone. This year I have the distinct pleasure of announcing the top 10 teams of Simcoe County Region for Remax Hallmark Che. And they are. Number 10, Joe Little, Cassidy and Joe Real Estate Group. Number nine is Trevor Shaw, the Trevor Shaw team. Number eight is Neil Bailey Hay, the Bailey Hay team. Number seven, Brendan Clemens, the Clemens Advantage. Number six, Diane Bolshane of Team Bolshane. Number five, Craig Butcher of the Butcher team. Number four, Scott Wolseley and Steve Knowles of the Knowles Wolseley team. Number three, Ann Chilton and Lance Chilton of the Chilton team. Number two, Curtis Goddard, the Curtis Goddard team. And the number one team is Peggy Hill of the Peggy Hill team. Once again, congratulations to all of our amazing Simcoe County Hallmarkers. It was an incredible year, trying times for everyone. You should be very proud of your amazing achievements. Congrats. Two thousand and twenty Career Award recipients.
2020 Individual Award Recipients. Team Award Recipients.
Good morning, everyone. I hope you enjoyed the program so far. First of all, big congratulations to the Simcoe County. Amazing job. Congratulations to all of you. I do remember when I started my career, how important was awards? How important was receiving an award? Because you cannot the feeling of the achievement and compare it to anything else. And this year is my pleasure to introduce the top 10 under 35 of our young entrepreneurs within the Remax Hallmark Group of the company. So let me start by number 10. Number 10, Tristan Peltier, Ottawa. Number 9, Heather Boucher, Simcoe County. Number 8, Scott Woosley, Simcoe County. Number 7, Robert Stortini, Toronto. Number 6, Andrew Polito, Durham Region. Number 5, Derek Hooper, Ottawa. Number 4, Sean Tehriria, Toronto. Number 3, Joshua Iking, Ottawa. Number 2, Brandon Polsinello, York Region. Number 1, Curtis Goddard, Simcoe County. Congratulations for your outstanding award. Let's talk about Ottawa. Five years of amazing journey. In 2016, Remax Hallmark decided to expand to Ottawa region. And it was one of the best decisions we ever made. We love City of Ottawa, and City of Ottawa has been an amazing journey with Remax Hallmark. Remax Hallmark has been the number one brokerage dominating the market in Ottawa and continue to dominate in years to come. It is my pleasure to present you different ca category of the achievement in City of Ottawa. I start by number one CHIO contributor, Pilon Real Estate Group. City of Ottawa and our realtor on a yearly basis contribute to different variety of the charity. And this year, number one CHIO contributor again goes to Remax Hallmark and the number one contributor, Pilon Real Estate Group. Number one commercial realtor, James Palmer, has been an icon in the city of Ottawa by practicing commercial for years. And this year, number one individual commercial practitioner, James Palmer. Number one individual for the number of the units. It takes a lot to do many transactions. And this year, this award goes to Sharon Jordan. Number one individual for volume, which is speaks highly about dedication and commitment to their clientele base, goes to Michelle Coupe. Number one team for number of the units and volume, Pilon Real Estate Group. Congratulations, Pilon and team. And Rising Star Award. This is an outstanding achievement for a young entrepreneur that has entered real estate market for the first time and in the less than 12 months has achieved its outstanding award. And this year, Rising Star Award goes to Yannick Dashner. Congratulations to all of you. It is my pleasure now to present you the top 10 individual in Ottawa region. By starting number 10, Shamir Daya, Bronson. Number 9, Serge Papineau, Bronson. Number 8, Sylvain Bergon, Innes. Number 7, Natalie Belvick, O'Connor. Number 6, Anna Turner, Bronson. Number 5, John Builder, Carly. Number 4, Sharon Jordan, Canada. Number 3, Michelle Danfus, Bronson. Number 2, Michelle Coupe, Bronson. And number 1, Josh Iking Bronson. Congratulations to all of you. Now, let's take a look at the top 10 teams in our Ottawa region. Number 10, Nim Musa, Nim Musa Team, Carling. Number 9, Jenna Swingwood, Jenna and Co Realty, Canada. Number 8, Jeff Gauthier, Jeff Gauthier Team, O'Connor. Number 7, Susan Shell, Susan Shell Team, O'Connor. Number 6, Kim Tran, Team Tran, Bronson. Number 5, Glenn Floyd, D. Floyd Team, Bronson. Number four, Jeff Hooper, the Hooper Home Team, Bronson. Number three, Maha Shabazian, the Ottawa Real Estate Team, Bronson. Number two, Bill Meyer, the Tulip Team, Bronson. And number one, Jason Pilon Real Estate, Pilon Real Estate Group, Innes. Well done, congratulations to all of you. Now let's listen to our manager who will name the top three individual for Ottawa offices. Once again, congratulations to all of you. Continued success. Hi everyone, I just wanted to say congratulations to all of our amazing award winners for a spectacular 2020. The number three individual in our Bronson location is Michelle Danfus. 
Our number two individual at our Bronson location is Michelle Coupe. And our number one individual for our Bronson location is Josh Eiking. Congratulations to everyone. Congratulations to our top three agents at Carling Avenue office. Number three, Sean Jensen. Number two, Sona at Tribe. Number one, John Builder. Congratulations to everyone. It gives me great pleasure to announce the top three award winners for our Canada location on Eagleson Road. At number three, Chris Sherry. At number two, Travis Gordon. And at number one, Sharon Jordan. Congratulations to all the award winners on a phenomenal year. Wishing you all the best in 2021. The top three agents at the O'Connor office. Number three, Ray Smiley. Number two, Bob Fraser. And number one, Natalie Bellamy. Congratulations, everyone. Once again, it gives me great pleasure to announce the top three award winners at our Orleans office on Innis Road. At number three, Brittany Golden. At number two, Irene Walensky. And at number one, Sylvain Bourbon. Congratulations to all on a phenomenal year. Wishing you a wonderful 2021. 2020 Career Award Recipients. Individual Award Recipients.
2020 Team Award Recipients. Congratulations, Hallmarkers, on your success in 2020 to all of you award winners from all of our regions. I hope that you had the opportunity to visit us at your peer-to-peer -peer mastermind groups. We met for the first time in February. So if you haven't had a chance to visit your group, check the training and events.ca calendar and we hope to see you there. Continued success in 2021. Good morning and welcome to our 2020 awards ceremony. Who would have ever thought that we'd be doing this a second time virtually, but I'm glad you're here. So let's enjoy. We're gonna be going through all the awards this morning. I'd like to start with uh, the awards given to our top contributors for CMN. Let's start with Ottawa. So in Ottawa, the money goes to CHEO, which is the Children's Hospital of Eastern Ontario. And Remax Hallmark is the number one contributor with over $53,000 given, which is incredible. And the top three agents uh, for donations are Nancy McCluskey, Natalie Belovic, and number one was Jason Pilon. So thank you very much. And the kids, thank you. Remax Hallmark as a company has eight realtors in the top 30 agents who donated all across Ontario. So number 25 out of 30 was Cameron Levitt. Number 23, Brian Kondo. Number 18, Fatima Bregman. Number 14, Terry Schneider. Number 12, Brian McIntyre. Number eight, Frank Polsonello. Number five, Jacqueline Pennington. And the number two agent in Ontario was Ralph Cianchio. Ralph also has the honor of being the number one contributor at Remax Hallmark. So I'd like to thank each and every one of you for your donations. Uh, as a company, Remax Hallmark donated over $204,000 last year, including Barrie Simcoe County, Ottawa, and the greater Toronto area. So thank you very much for your contributions. I would also like to acknowledge Anita Van Roosleer from Guelph, Ontario, who recently joined us, is now with Hallmark. She was a contributor to the London Hospital, so congratulations, Anita. I'd like to acknowledge and congratulate the top 10 individuals in our five regions throughout Ontario. That's approximately 1,700 realtors, and here are your top 10. 
Number 10, Perinthi Nagaratnam, Durham Region. Number 9, Pierre Carpaccian, Toronto. Number 8, Paul McDonald, New York Region. Number 7, Robert Francis, Toronto. Number 6, Jacqueline Pennington, Northumberland County. Number 5, Rob McDonough, Simcoe County. Number 4, Jamie Dempster, Toronto. Number 3, Fatima Bregman, Toronto. Number 2, Joy Verde, Toronto. And the number one individual in 2020 throughout the whole company is Claudio Cerrito from Toronto. Congratulations to you all. Moving on to the top 10 teams company-wide in all five regions. The number 10 team in 2020, Michelle Fraser. The Michelle Fraser team, Toronto. Number nine, Curtis Goddard. The Curtis Goddard team, Simcoe County. Number eight, Bill Meyer. The Tulip team, Ottawa. Number seven, Al Sinclair. The Al Sinclair team, Toronto. Number six, Jason Pilon, the Pilon Real Estate Group, Ottawa. Number five, Audrey Azad, the Estate Group Realty, Toronto. Number four, David Batori, David Batori Team, Toronto. Number three, Daryl King, the Daryl King Team, York Region. Number two, Mark Richards, the Richards Group, Toronto and the number one team in 2020 throughout our five regions is Peggy Hill, the Peggy Hill team, Simcoe County. Congratulations to all of you, just outstanding achievements. Every year we like to acknowledge an agent who had joined us in the previous year for outstanding production. This person is named our rising star, Mario Mendoza from the Bayview Village office. Congratulations on an outstanding year. What a heck of a year to start in real estate. And I look forward to seeing what you do in years to come. So congratulations, Mario. And now I'd like to pass it on to Michael McLaughlin, who's going to talk about our Greater Toronto Area Awards. Wow, what a great award show so far. Congratulations to all those in Ottawa and Simcoe County. And now I'm gonna announce the top 10 individuals in the Greater Toronto area. In number 10, Ryan Abassi, Baby Village Office. Number nine, Pintini Nagaratha, in the Ajax Office. Number eight, Pierre Carpetin, in the Leslieville Office. Number seven, Paul McDonald, Aurora Office. Number six, Robert Francis, in the Leslieville Office. Number five, Jacqueline Pennington, Northumberland. Number four, Jamie Dempster, Davy Village Office. Number three, Fatima Bregman from the Riverdale Office. Number two, Joy Verde from the Merton Office. And number one, Claudio Cerrito from the Merton Office. Congratulations. And now let's look at sales achievements in the greater Toronto area. The number one commercial realtor is Justin Kua. Number one commercial team, Steve Barry and Jenna Doran team. Number one individual for a number of units, Jacqueline Pennington. Number one individual for volume, Claudio Cerrito. Number one team for number of units and volume, the Daryl King team. And now the top 10 teams in the Greater Toronto area. Number 10, Ray Cochran, the Ray Cochran team in the Beach office. Number nine, Christopher Biddy. Bibby Group, out of the Merton office. Number eight, Lino Archie. Lino Archie team, out of the Merton office. Number seven, Mary Roy. Mary Roy team, out of the Ajax office. Number six, Michelle Fraser. The Michelle Fraser team, out of the Baby Village office. Number five, Al Sinclair. The Al Sinclair team, out of the Beach office. Number four, Audrey Azad. The State Group Realty, out of the Beach office. Number three, David Batori. David Batori team out of the Merton office. Number two, Daryl King, the Daryl King team out of the Richmond Hill office. And finally, number one, Mark Richards, the Richards group out of the Beach office. Congratulations to everybody. And now let's join our managers who will announce the top three individuals in each office. I'd like to 
congratulate everyone on their success in 2020, and I would like to announce the top three individuals of the Richmond Hill office. Number three, Lisa Sinopoli. Number two, Kamran Tajajot. And number one, Graham Jones. Once again, congratulations to all. Congratulations to all of our agents in Durham Region. 2020 was a challenging year, but with your resilience and persistence, you've pulled through it, and here I am to congratulate our top three individuals in our three offices. In Pickering, number three, Sherry Hoover. Number two, Kalev Koo. And number one, Andrew Palillo. Congratulations. Outstanding efforts and outstanding results at Remax Hallmark York Group in Aurora. We'd like to take this time to congratulate the top three individuals. Number three, Gemma Leggett. Number two, Jareen Thompson. And number one, Paul McDonald. Congratulations. Hey Hallmarkers, first of all I'd like to congratulate each and every single one of you for your fantastic efforts in 2020. Here are the top three individual award winners for the Bayview Village Office. Number three, Ari Zadigan. Number two, Ryan Abbasi. Number one, Jamie Dempster. Congratulations everybody and let's have a fantastic 2021. I'd like to congratulate everybody on a challenging but successful year and announce the top three individuals in our College Street office. In number three, David Stoddard. Number two, Bruno Soros. And number one, David Bierkamp. Congratulations. I'd like to congratulate everybody on a phenomenal 2020. What a great year. Uh, I'd like to recognize the top three individuals for the Merton office. Number three, Mark Arnstein. Number two, Joy Verde. And number one, Claudio Cerrito. Congrats all, all the best. And now the top three individuals in our Riverdale office. Number three, Kenneth McDonald. Number two, Pat Gillis. And number one, Fatima Brightman. Congratulations. And now let's look at our top three individuals in our Ajax office. Number three, Kenneth Toppin. Number two, Dorothy Harrison. And number one, Printhini Nagaratnam. Congratulations once again. And now the top three individuals at the beach office. Number three, Jalinda Green. Number two, Dave McLean. And number one, Tommy Leotis. Congrats, everyone. And now the top three individuals in our Leslieville office. Number three, Robert Stortini. Number two, Pierre Carpetin. And number one, Robert Francis. Congratulations. And now our top three individuals for our Whitby office. Number three, Laura Balasario. Number two, Shauna Trudeau. And number one, Jennifer Langeo. Once again, congratulations on a phenomenal 2020. And now the top three individuals at the Muskoka office. Number three, Suzanne Martineau. Number two, Kai Tookums. And number one, Ross McLean. Congrats, everyone. Two thousand and twenty career award recipients.
2020 Individual Award Recipients.
2020 Team Award Recipients.
Well, what a production. Uh, we have to thank Shant for this. Uh, not only did he put this whole thing together, but he provided the most amazing voiceover that I've ever heard <laughs> in my 41 years of doing these productions or being involved with this. So, Shant, props to you, buddy. Uh, I don't know how you got that voice going, but it was incredible. We had some buffering problems on that. We're going to clean all that up and put it online. It'll be perfect when we have it up there. But congratulations to Shant. Uh, we just want to uh, close this out by uh, talking about a couple of things that are really near and dear to us. And one of them is, uh, for me, is our Hallmark Giving Foundation. Uh, many of you might not know that we have a not-for-profit foundation at Remax Hallmark. It was started years ago in Ottawa, and we're pleased to present it. We have presented it all throughout the company this year. And it's, it's really near and dear to my heart. Uh, a lot of uh, different charities, local charities are supported. Barrie, Simcoe County, Toronto, Ottawa, Prince Edward County, everywhere. And it's from money that we raise through Hallmark Giving, giving the foundation. And this year, we're going to give an award for the uh, person or individual that donated the most throughout the whole company to Hallmark Giving. And I'm very proud and very pleased to announce that that award this year goes to Bill Meyer of the Tulip Team in Ottawa. Woo Bill, congratulations. Uh, the contribution you make, not only in your work and your support of peers, but in the local charity is outstanding. Thank you so much. It means so much to us. Um, so, at Hallmark, we have three pillars. Pillars are, we're in the business of building your business, how you grow your business, uh, contribution to the community, and certainly we're guardians of the industry. So, we have a thing that's called the Hallmark Award of Excellence, based on these three pillars. And this is where we come in. We're going to talk about uh, these people that are given the awards this year, and I'm going to talk about Simcoe County. And I, if you follow this person online, uh, you will see that he is quite the outdoors man. He's very committed, very generous with his time, his energy, and he certainly is, makes a big contribution to the community. He works in the east end of Barrie. He's been in this business in our company for 28 years. He, every year, he goes out with his wife, Carol, to get donations, money from his farm. He works in the east end of Barrie. And he contributes over the last eight or nine years probably close to twenty thousand dollars, and fifteen twenty thousand pounds of food have been contributed, all in support of the food bank. Wow. So, our Simcoe County Award of Excellence this year goes to Bob Bellamy. Congratulations, Bob! <laughs> You're an inspiration. Uh, the food bank of uh, Simcoe County, Barry, is, is thankful for the work you're doing there. So, thank you. You got the award. <laughs> Next. Well, now it's my turn to announce the individual in Ottawa region. Uh, this individual has been with the network for over 25 years. Wow. She's devoted to the community. She loves the city of Ottawa. She works city of Ottawa. As was Ken said, also the Award of Excellence was created about 10 years ago at Remax Hallmark. And the foundation of the Award of Excellence is about the community care, yeah. being professional, being respectful to your peers, contributing to your peers, and I am honored to announce this year recipient of the Award of Excellence in Ottawa region, Linda King. Woo! Linda contributed to many charities, handbags, uh, and the hunt club, and sending the kids to camps, many other uh, charities that on a yearly basis uh, she's involved. Congratulations, Linda. We are so proud of you. Thank you. Congrats, Linda. I have the honor of presenting this award to someone in the Toronto GTA area. Uh, this agent is very passionate about giving back to the community. She is a single mother of a teenage son with cerebral palsy. She's dedicated to helping children with disabilities, fundraising for Variety Village and Holland Bloorville Kids Rehabilitation Center. She's involved with the Rotary Club. And she was instrumental in getting Remax Hallmark involved in the Feed It Forward project, preparing meals for people with food insecurities, which many of you joined in to help volunteer this year. She has inspired all of us, and I couldn't be any prouder to present this year's Remax Hallmark Award of Excellence to Mary Jo Veratis out of our Merton Street office. So congratulations. congratulations. Well, uh, this is the end of our program. Uh, we have a little bit of a surprise for you. 
uh, look out for the announcement coming to your branches. We have organized professional photographer comes to every branch. We have to make sure that we have followed the protocol of the COVID physical distancing, but the professional photographer will be scheduled coming to your branch as soon as all the awards are arriving and you can have a professional photo done with your awards, celebrate it. And also we are arranging through the photographer a personal photo shoot for you. So enjoy it, be safe, stay safe, stay healthy, and we look forward to seeing all of you during the 2021. Thank you. Have a great year. Congratulations, everybody.